So this time we'll be answering mathematics first quarter module two. How will how are we going to solve problems involving sets? So this is solving problems. Problem uh, solving problems involving sets. So let's proceed to the next page. So we have here. Okay. So there is a Venn diagram here. And the problem is above. A group of 90 students were asked if they like banana, mango, and pineapple. And this Venn diagram here, this is our basis for our answers in the next page. So look at the Venn diagram. There are three circles and each of the circle represents sets. So this is this circle. This is the circle for banana. So this circle also represents pineapple and this circle represent mango so these are the numbers in its respective region of its set okay now this 20 this is banana only this 16 is mango only and this 8 is pineapple only and this 5 is banana and pineapple only and this 2 is mango and pineapple only and this 4 is banana and mango only and this 10 these are the students who like the three fruits banana mango and pineapple now here is the question for number one how many students like both banana and mango so talking about banana and both banana and mango we are actually asking about intersection of sets intersection of sets now if we are to look at here on the drawing so the banana and mango so here banana and mango the intersection of banana and mango so disregard pineapple you are to cover it so this is the circle for mango and this is the circle for banana and this portion here is the intersection of banana and mango this portion here so there are numbers inside it that's 4 and 10 when you add 4 and 10 the answer is 14 so therefore the answer for number one here like both banana and mango the answer is 14 now, number two questions, how many students like all three fruits in the survey? All three sports, uh, fru uh, all three fruits in the survey. So, we are actually asking for the intersection of banana, ban banana, intersection, mango, intersection, pineapple. So, the center. Now, the answer for this question number two, intersection of the three sets, the answer is this one, 10. That's the intersection of the three sets. So, the answer for letter B is 10. Okay, number three. How many students, number three, we have how many students like pineapple only? So, only, pineapple only. Look at the Venn diagram again, Pineapp pineapple only. So pineapple only, so this one is pineapple only. So the answer is eight. So this portion here is the pineapple only. So this is eight. So we are on number three. So eight, pineapple only. Now next for number four, how many students do not like any of the three sports? And how are we going to answer this one? Do not like any of the three sports uh, fruits. Now, from the given here, we have there are 90 students. Now, you are to add up all the, the numbers inside the three circles. 20 plus 5, that's 25. Plus 10, 35. Plus 4, 39. 39 plus... 2, 41, 41 plus 8, 49, 49 plus 16, 
65. So there are 65 in all. So 20 plus 5 plus 10 plus 4 plus 2 plus 8 plus 16 is 65. So we have 65 in all. Now, there are 90 students. Now you are to subtract 90 minus 65. So the answer is 5, 2. So there are 25 they are there are 25 students who do not like all the three fruits so here let's go back to the question number four how many students do not like any of the three fruits the answer is 25 at number five what is the cardinality of the of the universal set in the survey so cardinality of universal set this is you are to count out. So the cardinality of the universal set here is the problem, the given problem. There are 90 students in all. So you are to add up all of these numbers, including the 25. It sum up to 90. So the answer for number, what number is this? Number 5 is 90. Number 5 is 90. Now, number six. So, we have number six. In a class of 45 students, 10 members of both science club and math club, 22 are members of the science club and 13 are members of the math club, but not the science club. How many students in the class are not members of any of the two clubs? Now, this is a set problem. How are you going to answer this problem? So, from the given... So you are to understand the problem. There are 45 students. 10 members of both science club and math club. 22 are members of science club. Mem uh, are members of science club. And 13 are members of math club but not science club. How many students in the class are not members of any of the two clubs? So this question is asking about the complement. Okay, now, how will we answer this? So, the best way to answer this number 6 is through Venn diagram. Now, Venn diagram, okay, from the given, there are 45 students. That's you, 45 students. Okay, now, how? what are the subjects involved in this problem? So, we have the science club and the math club. So therefore, there are two subjects involved. Therefore, we will draw two circles. Two circles. And uh, first thing to do is to, to locate or to identify what number should be written here. The, the intersection of the two subjects. So maybe, okay, this is science club and this is math club. Now, if we are to read again the problem, we are to fill in the intersection of science club and math club. So from the problem, 10 are members of both science club and math club. So this, this uh, statement uh, denotes about intersection. So 10 is here, both science club and math club. Now, from the next problem, science, how many are science? What science? And math club. 22 are members of science club. So 22 are members of science club. So this is a circle for science club. This should be 22. And there is 10 already. What is lacking to 10 to get 22? The answer is 12 is here. And for the a math club, and 13 are members of math club. 13 are members of the math club. Okay, but not science club. Okay. Now here, we're actually writing 13 here. You understand? So, 10 are members of both science and math club is here. 22 are members of the science club. So we have already 10 here. So what is lacking to 10 to get 
22, that's 12. 12 plus 3 is 22. And next is 13 are members of the math club, but not science club. So this is math club only. So here. Now. Now. Here's the question. Okay. Here's the question. How many students in the class are not members of any of the two clubs? So this question is asking about the complement of the two circles, the two sets. So outside. If we add up all of these, 12 plus 10, 22. 22, 12 plus 10 plus 13, that's 5, that's 35 in all. And there are 45 students. So, 45 minus 35, the answer is 10. So, therefore, here, there are 10 students who are not member, member of any of the three clubs. So the answer is letter C. Okay, do you understand? Okay, next question. Now, number seven. Okay, number seven. So, 50 teachers were asked if they like science class, regular class, or both. So, if 35 teachers like regular class and 10 teachers like both, how many teachers like science class only? Now, again, you will make a Venn diagram out of this problem. You will make a Venn diagram. Okay, you will make a Venn diagram, and in a Venn diagram, the problem is 50 teachers were asked. So, there are 50 teachers in all. So, your universal set is equal to 50. How many subjects, how many subjects mentioned on the problem number 7? So, there are two subjects. We have science class, regular class, uh, two classes. Science class and regular class. So, because there are two which was mentioned on the on problem number seven, therefore you will draw two circles, two sets. And this first set is for the science class. And this second circle is for the regular class. And proceed reading the problem. If there are 35 teachers like regular class and 10 teachers like both. So we will solve first this one. 10 teachers like both means intersection of science class and regular class. So 10 should be written at the center. 10. Now after that, you go back to the problem. If 35 teachers like regular class, so there are 35 teachers like regular class. So this is the circle for regular class and this should be 35. There is 10 already. What is lacking to 10 to get 35? The answer is 25 for regular class. Now for science class, and teachers like both, how many teachers like science class only? Okay, science class only. So we are asking about science class, this one. Okay, now, is there any number on the problem? Is there any number written in our, in this space here? There is none. So therefore, the answer of number seven is, okay, how many just like science class only? The answer is zero. Zero. 